No. Well, Joe, as we've just been saying, it's disappointing to go off not having won that, but there were so many positives from, from the whole day, weren't there? Yeah, yeah, massively. Um, you know, coming into the game, both sides were in good form. Um, we've won nine in a row. I think they're probably similar. Uh, probably a, a, a good game for the neutral. I um, thought we probably controlled the first half really well, played, played some lovely football. Uh, and then um, second half, we... we they kind of found an extra gear and, and we struggled to, to cope with it. Uh, so, you know, overall on balance, I think it's it's telling that we're disappointed with a draw and it's mm. telling, I think, that, that they're very pleased with a draw. Maybe we probably edged it, but it, it's a close one. Mm. That for a first half performance, I'm particularly impressed with the passing and defining gaps all over the park. The diagonal balls there were exceptional and you got your rewards with, with those two goals, didn't you? Yeah, it's something something we work on a lot in training. Um, we want to be a, a good passing side. We we want to to find the gaps in opposition's defence. Um, be patient with the ball. Um, we want we we agreed at the at the start of the season that we want to play attractive football and, mm. and not just rely on you know quick strikers or shots from outside the box. You know we want to play a certain way and. I think we, we, we largely stuck to that today. Um, probably broke down a little bit in, in the second half where we, where we were panicking a little bit. Um, it, it kind of felt like there were waves of attack. Uh, but generally speaking, we, we try and play a passing game, control possession and, and play that way, yeah. Mm. The penalty, as it turned out, proved crucial, didn't it? Yeah, and, uh, you know, it did. But then could we have done more with, with either of the goals? Yes, probably. Mm. Uh, there were other opportunities to, to see the game away. I don't think I don't like looking at individual um, aspects. Uh, you know, mm. it's the game as a whole. Um, it's not it's not decided on on those exact moments. It's decided over ninety minutes. Yeah. Cray worked hard, and they they got their reward for it in the end. Yeah. And um, what happens now? You've got what well, I gather and you've got them in a cup competition, and obviously you've got the return fixture as well. Yeah. As I was just saying to, to two of your players, it does look like a two-horse race now, doesn't it? Yeah. Well, the thing is, we've said we don't like to look at the league table. We mm -hmm. we, we we are it's cliche, but we are next game. Mm -hmm. um, next game is next week, Borough Green. Then then we've got a, another one before the end of the season. Uh, before the end of uh, we're going to the Christmas break. Uh, our focus is on winning those two. Mm. Um, that unbelievable, really, that that side played as well as that when in the summer you didn't know each other. You've gelled that side really quickly. Haven't you? Yeah, uh, and it's a it's a bit of a mix. It's difficult because some of the players know each other from previous teams. Mm. Some of the players um, are are young. We, we've taken some from the Tunbridge Juniors setup. Mm. Um, I think today we had probably four or five players who were in their teens. Um, and to come into this environment, um, into a game, uh, you know, where it's close, it's it's a tough game, both both mm. physically um, and obviously the, the the pressure at the end of the game. Mm. Um, I, I'm very proud of the players that, that we've we've got, and very proud of how we've managed, like you say, to, to gel and, and create a team that that look like they've played together for longer. Yeah, um, that's very really much so. pleasing. Yeah, and there were players there, you know, I, I, I heard, I was pointed out to me during the game, which ones were the teenagers, because I, I couldn't tell. Everybody yeah. looked like, we know, were saying they, that. Were, they, were, they, were, they were grown adults. Yeah, we were saying <laughs> that. And, you know, there were, there were a lot of good performances today, yeah. um, especially first half. Uh, but to your point, that Frere in the centre midfield, mm. um, she won her physical battles yes. for the whole game. Um, and she is a teenager. And this is her first year playing adult football. So a lot of credit has to go to, to the young ones. Mm. Um, and as well to, to the, uh, I, I won't say older ones, to the more experienced <laughs> ones who are kind of guiding, guiding the young ones through. Um, this, this squad is really nicely balanced. Mm. Um, and, and like I say, we, we try to play a certain way. And overall today, pleasing. Obviously, the, the result's disappointing, but uh, a lot of positives. Brilliant. Well, congratulations on what was a really impressive performance today. Best of luck for next week. Thank you very much.